If you are having lag, stutters and low FPS in Fortnite with your low-end PC or laptop, so today in this video I'm gonna show you the best optimization tool that will help you to getting the best possible performance out of your PC. So guys make sure to watch this entire video till the end, if this is your first time here please subscribe, drop a like and let's get straight into over this video. Everyone wants to get higher FPS and lower ping while they're playing games. So guys gear up booster will help you to maximizing your FPS and reduce your network latency. It is super easy to use this tool, you shall feel the difference in just one click. So guys download this tool from the link in the description without adding any payment details. So guys you need to download the updated version of the optimizer on your PC and this software will help to optimizing our windows for the best gaming performance guys you can download the link from the description so guys simply go there and download this optimizer on your pc after that double tap and open up this application on your pc here you will get the very clean interface of the software but guys before going toward the optimization i suggest you to create a restore point on your pc so go for your window search search for restore and you will find that create restore point now go for your local dc go for configuration make sure to turn on the system protection and set it on two percent after that hit apply click ok now you need to go for this create button and name it like ripex and click create and create this restore point on your pc so guys now we can start over this optimization without any fear because now we have the restore point so guys in the very first step of this optimization tool you need to go for the general tab there you will find our system settings app settings privacy and disk drive settings in the system tab you need to enable all the settings on your pc because this will help you to optimize your windows and disable all the unnecessary services and program that is running in your background so guys turn on optimize performance turn on show all notification icon remove menu delay optimize your network disable error reporting disable compatibility assistant disable printer services then fax services sticky keys and smart screen and everything by just simply clicking on these buttons now on your right side you will find out here this app tab make sure to turn on all settings then privacy make sure to also turn on all the settings and then here you will find out disk drive option simply disable super fetch and disable hibernation on your pc and keep the other settings onto the default after that now if you have windows 10 or 11 you will find out here the windows 10 or 11 tab simply go inside it and there you will find a lot of settings like here you will find out system settings privacy gaming touch windows update and everything now here in the very first step the most important settings in over this tab that is the gaming so make sure guys turn on the game mode disable xbox live and disable the game bar on your pc now you need to go for the next step that is the privacy so disable telemetry service disable cortana enhance privacy disable news and interest then disable the smart menu ads and disable edge telemetry and disable the edge discover once you disable all the settings now you need to go for your system tab here you will find out disable my people so enable the settings disable sensor services we are not using any kind of sensors on our pc so guys simply disable it remove cars to device then disable virtualization based security so disable the settings on your pc now you need to go for your windows update tab and there you will find out disable automatically update if you want to stop the windows from automatic update your windows in the background so guys you can enable this option but i'm not enabling it because i want to make my windows up to date so i simply leave this tab and i need to go for this task bar so i also suggest you simply leave all the settings on your pc because this will just the visual settings now here is the extra also leave the settings now guys let's go for the next step that is the universal windows app there you will find out all the app of your windows so simply skip this tab now go for startup there you will find out all the startup application like you can also stop this application but guys i have I've already set up all the settings in my task manager simply therefore leave the start tab now next here in the apps tab you will find that all the apps like you can install it on your pc in just one click like check mark on these apps click onto the download button and download all this tab in just one click on your pc now let's go for the cleaner tab there you will find out your windows all the junk file your browsers all the junk files and temporary files so guys what you need to do you need to simply guys select out here all these files on your pc like simply select all this one from here or click on the select all button and select all these options from here after that you will find out here this option that is the clean so click on the clean button and this will delete all this junk data from your pc now go for the next tab that is the network tab and there you will find out your rapidly change dns settings so select out here your network adapter whatever you're using after that here you will find out this custom dns but guys we want to go with our normal now here you will find that your dns so click on the flash dns option to so reset your all the dns cache of your windows now click on the cs button and guys that's it now go for the next step that is about your host simply leave it 
go for registry there you will find out your registry settings so enable all options after that click on this fix button and fix all the registry issue on your windows now you need to go for the next step that is your hardware here you find all the detail of your hardware now go for the integrating this is just a simple tab then here is the option from where you can update your disk optimizer after every month so guys once you have done all the settings on your pc now here on the right side you will find out restart to apply change so guys click on this button it will ask you you want to restart so guys after restarting your pc now you can launch your any game and enjoy the best performance out of your pc or laptop i hope so you love this optimization please make sure to let me know in the comment section drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel to show your support so guys till at the next video peace out